says on top page top line on the top. Repetis is somebody is is it's Rabbi is Rabbi Yehiel coming? He he said he was coming. He said he's coming. Yeah. Okay. I ran into him. Okay. Okay. So Yeshem and some people say. They say the, the traditional bracha that you give is shnas haslacha shnas bracha should be a successful okay. year and a, and a, a good bench the year. Amen. Heish emrim. Some people say there's an opinion that says shamotu lavarech halitzer ben hashmoshes that you're allowed that that you're allowed to make a bracha and and on svidas emer and count the svida starting from ben hashmoshes. Ben hashmoshes means once it reaches shkia. Right? We know the shkia and the says like chavim. Once it becomes sunset, Shkia, even though it's not Seisei Chalim, Seisei Chalim is for sure nighttime. Starting from Shkia, and between that the Shkia and Seisei Chalim is called Ben Hashmashas. Ben Hashmashas um, is, is a time which is called, it's, it's the Safik Kim, Safik Lila. The Safik is the day uh, before, or it's already the night. Um, but is but he's, he brings an opinion that says, you're allowed to already start counting Sirius Salimer already, when it reaches being a shmash, we're ready when it's shkia time, even though it's not for sure night. You know, shmash is the shore of shemesh. Um, let me think, let me remember one second. I'll tell you why it's called being a shmash. There's a, there's, there's a reason. There's a reason why it's called being a Um, oh, I'll tell you why it's called being a shmash. It's called being a shmash because shemesh is the sun. Okay. The sun is referring to the day. So it's between Bain Hashmash is between oh, the two days, between the day of the past day and then and the next day. That's the reason brought. Yes, yeah. I think it's a, maybe even a Rashi, but yeah. Okay, so he says your ladder, so there's an opinion that says your ladder already begin counting the Surah Saimir, Afabish Safak Lila of Safak game, however, even though it's a Safak if it's night and a Safak of daytime, however, maybe it's maybe it's not not yet the next night. We want to start counting the second night, not the second night yet, because it's a Safak, maybe it's still the same the same day. He says, "I can say it's two days. It's maybe still the first day." Mm-hmm. Yeah. Since Svira today, since we don't have any more the Svira 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 is counting from they cut the carbon Um and then from when they from when they cut it, we count until Shuras, which is the when they bring the Shdei We count forty nine days. That's Nowadays we don't have a carbon aimer, we don't cut it, we don't have a base on mikdash. So, so it's only made rabbanon. The sphere same is only made rabbanon. So he says, since it's only made rabbanon, so we say self activity saving the hakal, anything which is a suffix in 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 something which is only made rabbanon. So then we're makel. Therefore, since we're makel, we could we could. So therefore, you could be ready to count from ben hashmash. Some people argue on this. The aim them and they say shall I cut chil and hachas after they suffer? I feel I'm a little bit safer. Now there's there's been hugging for for yemolad. That's you're aware of that, right? There's different. There's the Rebbe made uh, encourage people to do men hugging special men hugging. I made sure to go to the OL. I got an aliyah. I made a flata. I I didn't recite uh, my mer. Me a b bezrat is maybe next year. Could do it by Shabbos. You can say Shabbos. Shabbos. Uh, well, I mean, it's not Hebrew birthday. Yeah. 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 And then tomorrow. I come here. Okay. You can say the on water. What's the water? Yeah, water is good. His birthday tonight. His birthday. Yes, his birthday tonight. Have a birthday. Have a birthday. Amen. Zara Kana. Amen. Thank you so much. Specific. Amen. Amen. Okay. So we're holding a page up line. It's, we're continuing from yesterday. Yeah. Your base, yeah. Yeah, your base, yeah. Fine. So he says like this. Um, so we're talking about Sirius Aimer, counting the counting Sirius Aimer. Okay. So so there's uh, usually you're supposed to start uh, counting at nighttime when it's for sure nighttime, it's, which is called Seisek Echavim in, in, in Hebrew. You call it and That's when it's when we know for sure it's nighttime. Um, but there's a minute, there's an opinion which says you can already start counting already from sunset before it's it's before it's nighttime. There's a time called as Shkia, Shkia is sunset, 
And then there was Seisek Echavim was when the three stars come out. That's when it's for sure night. And from sunset until Seisek Echavim, until it's for sure night, there's a twilight time, yeah. which is, which is, a, which is a, it's a doubt if it's a daytime or the nighttime. It's called Ben Hashmashas. Doubt if it's still part of the, the past day or it's part of the next day. So we say, this opinion says, that you're allowed to start already counting the Omer already from um, Shkia, from ready from sunset. Yeah. Why? Because since um, counting the Omer is only rabbinic, it's only Midrabanon, so we're more lenient and we say that you could already count even, uh, already from the, to the time of sunset, even though you don't know for sure it's night, since possibly it's night. That's what we said in the beginning. The, you, uh, you, even though uh, you have not recited Marv yet, are you permitted to count Sira? Yes, or, or, we're or you, have to, about you have to wait until it's better. Mar- it's better to wait after Marv, but you can. It is mutter. Okay. But that's going to be a lot more soon. Okay. I, th- I thought that Sphere was Madaraisa. Far we, so we had yesterday that there's that there's an opinion which says it's that I saw correct even today. No, originally of course it's Minat but but that's but there's one opinion which says still even though we don't have the base of Mikdash and we don't have the carbon name, it's still Minat But we pass in like the opinion which holds that it's Midrabanan because since we don't have the carbon name anymore, we don't have we're counting from the from the from the sacrifice which they brought in the base in, in the, they brought in the temple a sacrifice. And they count up to the 49 days from when they brought that during Pesach, they brought the sacrifice, and we start counting 49 days from that sacrifice until Shavuos. Nowadays, we don't have that sacrifice because we don't have a Beis HaMikdush. So, um, one opinion says it's still uh, a biblical, it's still Minatayra, and another opinion says it's Midrabanan. So, nowadays, we say, as we said yesterday, nowadays we consider it, so the halach is that it's only Midrabanan, it's only rabbinic. So, when so, Mashiach comes, at Hashem soon. Have, have, I'll tell you, the question is what if Mashiach comes home. now? That's all. That's the discussion. Yeah. What's going to happen right if Mashiach is put it? We didn't have we didn't have the Omer, right? Same yeah. question is if someone became a Ger, right? So became a Ger in the middle of the same. Somebody became a Bar Mitzvah back in the middle of the same. All these different questions. A lot of, a lot of discussion I'm about. Say, I'm saying all this dinim that we learned, right? It's uh, I don't think Top it's accurate. Page Top Lamed. By the way, that that actually happened to. Me, I, I became a bar mitzvah at the beginning of Sphero. Oh, wow. Oh, right. Yeah, oh, oh, yes. oh, oh, right. Yeah. Right. Right. So, yeah. Okay. After, after so, so, just to repeat, yeah. uh, we, oh, we, we, we said this a few times, yeah. right? Just to repeat like, for, yeah. for, for, any, for didn't hear. So, we started with the base. So we just okay. started basically with the kids. So we started saying that you, if you're allowed to count, some people say a lot of start counting from Shkia, mm-hmm. a Sphero Samer, even though it's until it takes a problem, it's Suffolk Game, Suffolk Lila. It's maybe, maybe date time. Mm-hmm. So the opinion says it's okay since it's only midrabanon, so the same as only midrabanon. So therefore, you could start. Um, uh, um, they were lenient. So therefore, we're, we're lenient to allow to start ready from shkia. Um, but other people argue, and yishchilkim, and other people argue. Alza, it's like four lines from in yishchilkim alza. The line says chilkim. Some people argue with this. He says you shouldn't start counting ready from sunset. You should wait until it's nighttime. That's the other opinion. There's two opinions. Um, until it's for sure night, you shouldn't count because don't get yourself into a doubtful situation. It may be, it may still be daytime. How could you say that tonight is already the second night? It's not ready night, it's not night yet. So, so the second opinion says, No, you have to wait until it's for sure night time, which is called Seisek okay. and, and by the way, uh, it's important not to get the Yitzhar in the way to, to do it immediately because. If you push anything off, especially at night, you end up falling asleep. Right, right. That's correct. We said it. We said it yesterday. That's right. Try to do it right. Them, right. Um, is it known for sure what time the sacrifices were brought at Beit Hamikdash when it was in the Omer? Well, it was brought on the second, on the second, the day after, uh, the second day of Pesach, during the daytime. During the daytime. During the daytime. Yeah, yeah. There was nothing brought in the afternoon. I mean, it, closer to the evening time. So by the end of the day, the inner for sure was brought. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. So and and this is and he said this is what the those who are careful about the mitzvahs uh, are are careful to wait till till Sesekicham until for sure night time before they start counting serious Amer. That's it's befitting for people to wait until evening. So mm-hmm. okay. Nevertheless, he says, even though that's the way you're supposed to do it, you're supposed to wait. The, the common practice amongst people 
is to already from from sunset from shkia is already to count sviras emer, and they do have what to rely on. They do have this opinion which says that it's okay. So, but it's better to wait. But 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 it's okay for those who already start counting from sunset. Now, what happens if you're davening the shul, which they daven may have early, um, and they're davening right before shkia, right before sunset? They davening mincha, mincha, right before it's still they they daven. Uh, I'm sorry, may they daven even Mayrev before it becomes sunset. And you're allowed to daven Mayrev before, before, before sunset, as long as it's after Plaka Mincha, as long as there's a certain halachic time where you're allowed to start um, davening Mayrev. Um, so if you start, it's also if they started, if they daven Mayrev right before sunset, and then they're planning on, on saying Sirius Aimer right when it hits uh, Shkia, right when it hits Benashmash, right when it gets sunset. And that is a, com- a common custom that people say Sphira when it comes Benashmash, it comes by sunset. Right. So what happens? So what do you do? And you're from those people who like to wait. You don't like to to to, to count uh, right by You want to do it the best way. You want to do it when it comes when it comes nighttime. Right. What do you do? Right. What do you do right now? You're you're part of this minion which is counting by shkia. I uh, I remember the halacha. You're supposed to say to yourself, I ah. I don't have in mind when they they count the sphere. Almost, almost, you almost, almost got it. But it's a one big nuance, a very important nuance, it can make a big difference. But, but you're on the right track. He says, when somebody wants to be careful, wants to make sure to wait until the soul says, for sure, night to the suicide. And he's having a mighty while it's uh, while it's still daytime. He's at Sibir with the minion. And they're having a mighty right before Shkia. The same minion is Shmashas. And this minion is going to have when it comes to Ben Shmashas. What should you do? He says, You should. Count, like you said, you should count with them. Don't make a bracha. Don't make a bracha on the svira. Just count with them the svira. Mm-hmm. And the actual what should you think in your mind? Im eshkach lisur balaylev. If you get later at night, which means I'm planning, I'm going to count later later tonight because I want to count after after when it comes in, it says, like, when it's not for sure night. But I'm making a, a condition. I'm saying if I'm going to forget the count. Um, in nighttime, had any same chasvira zul lots of idichavasi. Then I I want to rely on this svira which I'm counting right now because if you're davening with the minion later, so you you remember to say svira when you know when with the minion. But if you're davening with the minion earlier, so there's a big chance you might forget later because you're by yourself and you don't have those alarms unless you don't unless you set yourself an alarm, yeah. you might forget to say svira later. So you say if I forget to to say Svira later, then I want to be Yitzhah with this Svira now by Shkia, according mm-hmm. to the opinions who say it's okay to start counting from Shkia. We don't say here, Berov Arma is right, Melech? Oh, so you're saying it, you're saying it now, but okay, but there's a Mile, but, but there's a, but Berevam had this Melech as a Hidr, but you want to go according to the opinion which says you're really supposed to do it at night time. So th- th- that's my stronger opinion over here. I feel that big minion, right now they're Davin, Berov Arma. So I'm doing good to... Yeah, that's a beautiful thing to do, but but not on the cost of a halacha. If the halacha is you're supposed to do it when it's for sure nighttime, so you can't say brave I'm had smell. know that. But so right it, now there are hundred people davening here. It's the wrong arm. I think it's overtake. Okay, now Tabas says no, it says only a hider. But if I'm had this malak, it's a hider. It's not it's not that it doesn't change the actual halacha. Now this is a machlek about the actual halacha about when you're when you're allowed to say it. If I don't forget tonight, let's go back to this condition. If I don't forget tonight, this is the moment. I'm having a mind not to be Yitzhah with the Surah. What's the difference? We'll explain this. There's a, there's a machlekes, do mitzvahs, when you do a mitzvah, do you have to have kavana in order to be Yitzhah? What do you mean kavana? I'm doing a mitzvah right now. Right? Um, so. Right. I don't know. I'm putting on tefillin. I know, I know I'm putting on tefillin. I know this is tefillin. I know I'm putting on tefillin. And, 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 and having a mind to do a mitzvah right now. So, so one opinion says, yeah, you have to have a mind to, 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 to have kavana. And if you yeah. don't have a mind, you're not yetzer. Yeah. The other opinion says that, that you don't have to, even if you don't have a mind to do the mitzvah, just by doing the mitzvah, you're yetzer the mitzvah. So, so, so now the halacha benigia min ha I think the main main halacha is that you, that you need you need kavana for a mitzvah min You need to have kavana. But by by drabanan, it's it's not so clear. So if a mitzvah you're doing a mitzvah which is only mit drabanan, okay. So like svirus aimer in our case, right? It's only mitzvah mit today. So 
we, we, it, it could be that your Yetza, there's a Machlekes, could be your Yetza uh, doing, saying Sirius Aimer, even if you didn't have a mind to do the mitzvah of Sirius Aimer. Just by saying the mitzvah, by saying the Sirius Aimer, even though you didn't have a mind to be Yetza the mitzvah, could be already Yetza with that mitzvah. By, by the saying, way, one of the mitzvah that you don't eat Kavana is eating Atza. You just have to eat the matzah. I mean, there's also a sheer involved, but now the difference is the reason. I don't want to get sidetracked, but, 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 but the, 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 oh, the exception of mitzvahs for Shnik Havana, the exceptions if you're, if you're having hana from it. Oh, okay. Mitzvahs which you're having hana, the goof has hana from, uh-huh. so then, then even if you don't have kavana, you're still yetzer. Okay. So that's why that's the matter different. Um, so it's like this. Um, so, so, so according to the, 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 the even according to those, Ah, so it's so like so if so let's say like, if so we submit so to same as is a drabanu, right? There is an opinion which says that you don't have to have if you say the oimer, even if you don't have a mind to be yitzu by saying the oimer, you don't have a mind to be yitzu the mitzvah of the oimer. Um, nevertheless, you're still going to be yitzu, right? So right now you're this minion. You're coming right for shkia. You're davening mayrev. You're davening by shkia. You're saying so to say by shkia, right? And you're saying it without a bracha. You're just saying. Hayyim Yayim Shayna Laimer together with everyone. You said those words, Yim Shayna Laimer. Now, if you're gonna say you're gonna say, okay, I'm not having a mind to be Yitza. This is where the nuances. I'm not having a mind to be Yitza. Okay, we don't need you to have a mind to be Yitza. You're Yitza anyhow, according to this opinion, who says that you don't have to have Kavana in order to be Yitza. Mm-hmm. So even if you have a mind, say, so I'm not having a mind to Yitza. No, Too bad. Bracha. You're still you're still being Yitza. But yeah. the Bracha, you say the Bracha. Well, according the bracha to this opinion. Opinion. So in in that case, it, it's better off in in the first case to say I don't have in mind and not to say it in the first place, right? Oh, so no, what do you do? You you're having in mind, mm-hmm. you're having a mind over here that that like he says, mm-hmm. but over here you can have a mind something different. You have a mind. I'm having a mind not to be it. I'm yeah. not. I'm not. Not having in mind to be Yitzha, I'm having in mind not, not to be Yitzha. That's exactly and what that, I do. So what, whatever you have what in I mind is, I go home and I say Sira every night with my wife. I say I have in mind not to be Yitzha because I'm going to say the Sira with my wife. I go home as soon as I walk in the door. I say we're dropping everything. We're going to stand up and we're going to do the Sira. We do it every night. But you have, what did you say? What did you what, what, How did you say it? I have a mind not to be Yitzha. Right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So the words well, even say. Ah, uh, uh, this is this is condition. It's, yeah. Wait one second. You were saying you wanted to say something. Yeah. Therefore, the words preclude the action. Yeah, the words preclude action or the thought. It doesn't have to. You don't have to actually say just the thoughts. If the you thought, have, yeah. yeah, right. Whenever you put your thoughts in words, even yeah. in your mind, you put them. Yeah, in yeah. Father, every yeah. night, you'd stand up. The whole family would stand. And he he would uh, recite the sphere, Everybody re- would uh, recite it. Right. And, so, and she loved the custom. Right. So that's what you're having. So this is the condition. Let's get back to the condition. So you're you're by Maidiv. After Maidiv comes Shkia, and so you have a mind when they're saying Sfira. You're not making the bracha. You're having a mind. You're saying Hayim Shenalei. You're having a mind not to be Eitzah. And you're saying and uh, no, you're saying like if I forget it later, so then I want to be Eitzah now. But if I if if I don't forget and I'm gonna remember later, so then now I don't want to be it. So you have to say bracha. He said if we just say yeah, it's right. Well, he's you, you don't want to because because really you want to say it later. Right. So that's why you're not saying the bracha because you want to say it later with the bracha. You're not but planning you forget, and forgetting. But you forget to say it later. But you're not you're planning s- and forgetting. You're planning and remembering. But if but you, you forget. forget. If you forgot, you lost the bracha. So you lost the bracha. Right? No, you know, you know, you could say, you could say, you could listen to the bracha of the, of the chazan. Say amen. You could listen to the bracha of the chazan. <laughs> uh, okay, so you said like is it possible to uh, to down before the three stars come out? So how to down uh, Arabic? If uh, okay, so we're going to talk about that soon. We're actually going to talk about that. We're going to talk at the end of this sif. We're going to talk about this this question. Didn't we say before that somebody asked you what's it today? But I'm saying you tell them what's exactly today. Hey, you can then count again. That's the same halacha, the same. But he, we're going to get to that also. Yeah. We're going to get to it. Well, this is the halacha. What you're saying is your dalit. So it's if you're dalit. Okay, so let's see. Now, um, this is the third paragraph in in Sif Yud Beis. It's Avon. Yeah, Avon. Lahis nebadaytiv efedish aloy lasit sudazuk shiskar alaylo. 
He just he can explain. He's just bringing it out, explaining it. But let's say he didn't make this condition clearly. He didn't make a clear. It has to be clear in your mind that you're not you you don't want to be Yitzchak. I will suffer stam. You counted stam. You just you said hayim sheni sheni b'aimer. Actually, beidach. Actually, beidach achshav. Even though you didn't make the bracha now, like like you were saying, you didn't make the bracha. The gamli on amen after bechaz at sibri. You didn't answer amen. La yivarech. You shouldn't make a bracha. She's from Laila. You shouldn't make a bracha tonight. The night. Why shouldn't you make the bracha? Shema hayekvar Laila because she's sibri bein hashmashes. Maybe it was already night. And you said it when you counted Vena Shmashis. And so now he's basically saying that what happens if if you didn't have a mind not to be Yitzha, you just had you just had a mind that's um that, that you're not being Yitzha, that you're you're not having a mind to be Yitzha. Just having a mind that you're that you're not having a mind to be Yitzha, right? So what you you said Stam, I'm I'm gonna say it now, but I'm not having a mind not to be Yitzha, right? I'm just saying it now. So then, you can't later say it again with the bracha. Tonight, that night, that night you can't, because maybe when you count the benashmashes, we consider it nighttime already, and therefore you're ready. According to the opinion, you would say that you don't need to have kavana to be yitzah. So it doesn't make a difference. It doesn't make a difference that you didn't have kavana, so you're still yitzah. Afshel, even kavana, even those. Oh, even though you have opinions which say mitzvahs do need kavana, mm-hmm. if a mitzvah in a Torah, we say that you have to have kavana. If you don't have kavana, it's, it doesn't work. But svira today is only mitzvah rabbanu. There's an opinion which says that that today everyone um, any mitzvah which is mitzvah rabbanu does not need kavana. So therefore, you're going to be yitzah. Makes sense. Yeah. Oh, now he goes even, even even stronger. He says, let's say you didn't even count. You were by this minion. You dab and might have, and you stuck around, and you didn't even say Hayyamim Shani. You just heard other people saying it. <laughs> Getting even more complicated. You heard, Sometimes yeah. at night, people space out. They're thinking about other things. And they hear everybody saying, but, but they forget to say it. It happens. We're human. Right. And in this case, this case, he's planning on saying it later. He wasn't planning on saying it now. He wants to wait. He didn't make this tonight. He didn't make this oh. condition. He said, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not counting. Now I'm counting. I'll count it in a, in a half an hour from now. I'll set my alarm. And he didn't count. He didn't even say it. I feel like this is the next paragraph. Um, I feel it. The fourth paragraph. Feel they suffered him cloud, even if he didn't count at all. He heard it from somebody else counting. I I never had that issue when I'm counting Sira. I always have that issue when I'm doing Krishna Alamita because sometimes I start saying it. If I, if I wait too long or it's late at night, I end up passing and end up going to sleep. But I've never had an issue with Sira, only with Krishna Alamita. Okay, good. Yeah. Excellent. So let's say you heard it from another person saying it. You didn't say it at all. And, didn't, and that person didn't have kavana to be mighty him. He also didn't have kavana to be yitzah. He didn't from, from that person. Usually you have to hear what the person is trying to be mighty. You're trying to trying to it has to have kavana. You have to have kavana for the person who is who is being made to you. Allah me, you heard it innocently. anymore. Why? Because the rule is Shashi Meyak Oina. When you hear something, it's as if you are answering, as if you are saying it back, or also saying it. Not only when you say Amen. Not only when you say Amen. He's... When you hear a Baracha, and you say Amen, I mean, it's true what you just said. So this is Shemak Oina. Even if you didn't say Amen. I feel like him over here, there's no Amen. You don't say Amen after Svita. There's no Amen after Svita. Just, just, uh, just uh, saying the day. Even if you're going to have a mind, I'm not having a mind to be Yetzir. Again, this, this idea of saying I'm not having a mind to be Yetzir, it's not going to help. Again, according to the opinion, it would say that mitzvahs don't need kavana. It's not going to help. Unless you have kavana, that I'm having kavana not to be Yetzir. By the way, this is this is again. I'm saying by this. Yeah, I'm saying by the when the chazan says it. Everyone, you're listening to the chazan. You're having a mind to listen because you dafka want to say it afterwards. So that's not a problem. Having a mind, you're listening to to in order to dafka say it afterwards. Close the bein hashmashes. 
What this is all if you are saying Svidus Aimer by Ben Ashmashes, which is after sunset. Then we say that if you said Svira by Nashmashes in any way, so then you can't say um, at nighttime anymore um, Svira or, or, or your Yaitse Svira, um, your Yaitse Svira from Ben Ashmashes according to the Minik. Avokay the Minik before sunset, a Minik cloud Lisper, there's no Minik at all. We don't find any Minik that you should be, you should count before sunset, before Shkia. Even out of Shabbos, which the custom is for many, is to bring in Shabbos early, before Ben Ashmashes, a long time before Ben Ashmashes, starting from Plaka Minchay, you can bring in Shabbos early. They don't, they don't uh, say the Sirius Amr in Shul while it's still daytime, before it becomes Shkiah. Not everyone counts the Amr when they get to their house in, in, in the time, whether it's Shkiah or whether, or whether it says like a what okay. happens? I remember one year we were at uh, my wife's family in the Cortland mm-hmm. Jewish Center, and uh, we we dive in early, and the rabbi announced to count the sira at the seder. At the seder, I think it was the second night. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. Where is this? Uh, in the Bronx, uh-huh. uh, in Cortland Park. Uh-huh. Yeah, we dive in sometime. We walk Friday night, early minyan, finish early, like eight o'clock. People just starting. So the rabbi get up and said, "Don't forget, bro. Yeah, this is fear. Right, you yeah. have an hour. Oh, so what happens if I mistake? You did it beforehand. He says, "This is the last uh, line of the page." Paflamet mim tal beimemono. Let's say it was a cloudy day and they made a mistake. Uberchol v'safro. They thought it was already shkia because it was dark because of the clouds. Mm-hmm. They didn't have clocks then. And you made the bracha, and you did you counted the svira of Achik Achni Spazer Avim. The clouds dispersed when Edeshe Kedem and Ashmash, and they saw it was still day. Srichim Naxir Lisper. You have to go. You have to count again. Um, you're not yetsa. Mm-hmm. Since it's before Shkia, you're not yetsa. Avlo Yivarach Shenis. Ah, but he says even though you're not yetsa, you still should make another bracha when you count again. Why do you make a bracha? This is going to get into the discussion what you were asking. As long as you counted from, and you made the mistake, you counted early, it was from after Plaga Mincha. It's the halachic time of Plaga Mincha. So then, you don't, you, when, even though you have to count again, we say you have to count again, but you don't make a bracha when you count again. Why? The minig of the ilam is to, to, to read Kriyash Mashallah Arvis, Kriyash Mashallah and then evening Kriyash the mit- from Plaga Mincha, starting from Plaga Mincha, even though it's, day, it's still, still, still during the day. Mm-hmm. Why? How could they do this? But it's not nighttime. Because Krishna has to be by nighttime. The same thing about Eimer Mishnah Plaga Mincha Veilech. The same should Kalayl in Tulas Avis Rabbi Yehuda. Kalayl in Elayl in Krishna Shal Avis. So you say like this. The opinion, the opinion of Rabbi Natan, Shita Rabbi Natan, the Entesos, he held like this. That Maidiv, Rabbi Huda, Rabbi Huda, one of the Tanoim, Rabbi Huda holds that you're allowed to um, stab a Maidiv um, starting from Plaga Mincha. The time of Maidiv is starting from Plaga Mincha. So, so that, that, okay, so that, that's Rabbi Huda holds. So, 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 taking Rabbi Huda holds, holds, so, holds that you should stab Mincha before Prague. Yes, you have to dive. According to that, you should dive in. But for Plaga, okay, that's another whole discussion. Um, even that, you know, whatever. It's it's a mass. That's a massive discussion. Okay, so let's keep it simple, right? So if you hold the holds that that you're allowed to start diving in from Plaga Mincha, right? That's why a lot of people in the Velt, they dive in Maida starting from Plaga Mincha. I see you dive in Erev Shabbos, Plaga uh, Maida early, right? Rabbi Huda, you're not like so, so that's that, that that's clutter. That's a clutter zah. That that's that's the there was no halacha wasn't paskins. Um, it, like it, it, it says, the other came out of it. The other came out of it. You're allowed to do it either from 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 uh, starting from plaka mincha or it says you're allowed to you're allowed you're allowed to do that. You're allowed to die matter early. Now the so the, but the time has an interesting shit that he holds that it's not only for Maidiv uh, 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 you're allowed to dive in um, my yeah, yeah, but also Kriyash Mashal Arvis you're also allowed to start diving from Pla- you say from Plaga Mincha not only at Maidiv which is in the I'm saying but even in Kriyash which is in the he says that just like it became nighttime for Maidiv you're also allowed to start from Plaga Mincha you're allowed to read Kriyash Mashal Arvis 
and 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 some a lot of people rely on this. A lot of people rely on it through through the generations. A lot of I have a question. Do do I have to wait till Marv is over to recite Kriya Shema Amita? Can I do it before Marv? If, if I I know I'm going to go to sleep after Marv. Or is Good question. Um, usually, usually say it. You could say it right after Maida. Right after Marv. Okay. Say I don't think that I think that everyone told somebody who would forget it that they can just say it right after Maida. Saying, saying it, 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 usually it's you're retiring for the night, so it's usually after Maida. I'm saying I don't think it's also to say it before. I'm saying it's not. It's not. It's not Isser in it, but I think the minute no, 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 it's okay. to say it right. it right after. Saying right. I guess if you're Gemanish, no, you're going to forget. It's, it's well, why would you forget? You're you're a middle. Clear, you're it's not, it's not a question of right. forgetting. It. It's as soon as I come home, I, sometimes I pass out. You could say Kishon right in Shul right after Maid. You could yeah. stay stay another two or three or whatever how long yeah. it takes. Yeah. Two minutes and and say Kishon in Shul. Yeah. A lot of people do that. That's the whole night. You know okay. that in the middle. You might fall asleep in the middle. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, no, they actually put in the footnote about the city to say, "Oh, hey." They also say, oh, hey, right. Well, my, well, my, my, we don't, we, we, we don't, you say, okay, no, we, there, they say there's a hirats and there's, um, the the that, show. that we say, but the al hate, even though it's in the sitter, it's not, it's not, uh, and this is say it? It doesn't okay. I once asked a pin the curve. Okay. So, no, 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 it's different things in the sitter, I'm saying, which yeah. which we don't do. I'm saying, you know. yeah. right, right. Um, so, so this Rabbi Rabbi Mina time holds the same thing when he gets to Shalom. The next to the day, this is ready starting for the Rishenim. There was, there was a lot of different uh minhagim and machlekes. There's really machlekes about when you show me about this, but that's that's the that that's that's uh that that they're they rely on this opinion. And this, so some people they say Kriyashma, they dive a mite, they say Kriyashma during during mite, and that's it, and they go to sleep, play whatever. Let's say you go to some kilos, uh, night is very late at night. So I'm saying, in, 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 mm -hmm. say it's England and Russia, certain places are, it's very late and people can't, can't stay up so late. So, so they can rely on it. You know, other people, they, they rely on Kriyash Shalomita, actually. They, they, they say, okay, later when, this, before they go to sleep, they say Kriyash Um So, so that's when they eat it. Back upon him, there is, there is a shita. Im Kane, so they want to say, According to them, who I didn't show Kalil in the Svidas Aimer be hold of the Fidivrayim. They want to say the same thing, maybe we could say when again Svidas Aimer, according to the according to them, you could say Svidas Aimer, it's also since it's considered night for Kriyashma, so we could say it's also night for Svidas Aimer, ready from Plaga Minchi, even though it's before Shkia, according to his opinion. He says, I bazay, if so, oh, very good. We have a shit which says that it's already night and ready from Plaga Mincha. So why can't you already count from from Plaga Mincha? Why do you why do you have to wait until Shkia or Tesakikhavim? Well, has man, don't you have to count again. You don't make a bracha again because because of that because of shita rabbi natan. But you do have to count to count again when it comes to time. If you iker ka imri mishem eplag hamincha in ifkasha kolayla afila rabbi huda mele in filo bovad. Rabbi leilin yishaydvanish in sasa v'alad kmis barav sim neshnei because the iker is not like the shita rabbi natan. The iker is that that you're not yet to kriyashma until it's already night time. You have to wait until it comes to sekechavim. In the words say Kriyashma. Right? So if you're in such a show which does it, so you should you should say, remember to say Kriyashma by nighttime, Kriyashma Shalom. To have a mind to say it later, to say Kriyashma. Say Kriyashma later. Um because Iker is not like that opinion. So therefore you're gonna have to if you if you counted Surah Aimer before um for Shkia, you should wait and uh, you should you should count it again later. But you don't make a bracha because since there's opinions that say that you already ate so already by from, from Plaga Mincha, so you're not gonna make the bracha again. Okay, you'd give more. I will make the actor king. So if you'd give more, I will make the actor king. This is where we say the Kahabim Shatavi in the moon. Now, what happens um, if, if um, let's say, people, a minion, which they usually always wait until, say, say Kahabim, they don't do it ready, say, uh, say, serious aim ready from Shkia from sunset. They usually wait until, say, say Kahabim until it's Mamish nighttime. Um, and no, and what happened was there were clouds and they made a mistake and they thought it's already Seisek Echavim, but really it was Ben Hashmashas. It wasn't date, it wasn't before Ben Hashmashas, it was already Shkia. But they usually wait until Seisek Echavim and they counted before Seisek Echavim after Ben Hashmashas. Saprabi Ben Hashmashas, in Sark Laksavis, were Kabbal Seisek Echavim, they don't need to count again. Pilabalei Bracha, 
um, they don't even need to count even without a bracha. That's already enough. If you count it by shkia, even though you made a mistake, you usually count by seis. You don't have to say it again. What he says, it, it still you should repeat it again by nighttime because there is an opinion which says so it's better to say it again. Okay, now this is the question which, which you were mentioning. It's a pretty famous halacha. A lot of people know about this because it's, I guess it's very relevant because people are always asking other people, what, what is the svita tonight? What is the svita, right? So everyone knows about this halacha. It's a very famous halacha, right? Now we're going to see it inside. Sif Yudalot. Somebody asks you, how many days of Svita are tonight? Mm-hmm. What, do you should, what, you should, what should you answer him? Yesterday was kach was this What's amount. Right? Okay. So this is the way Ayid answers. You tell him Shalom Aleichem, he tells him the opposite, Aleichem Shalom. Why can't he say back Shalom Aleichem? Ayid always says the opposite, right? You tell him what's today, he tells you yesterday. This is the way Ayid so, no, but there's a reason. There's a reason why. Why are you saying yesterday? If you're going to get tell him that today is kafakach, today is, 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 is the second day of the Imer, right? Um, you're not going to be able to say a bracha afterwards if you already said that. Why? Because mm-hmm. once you said out of your mouth yeah. that today is this amount of days, that's it. <laughs> like we said, according to the people, said, you don't have to have kavana to be yaitza. Even if he just said, Stamazai, yeah. didn't have a mind to be yaitza, he's still yaitza. When you told him he didn't have a mind to be yaitza, but he's still yaitza, according to that opinion, he says, you don't have to have kavana. Actually, you don't have to say the word la'aymer like we said yesterday. You didn't say, you didn't say today's the second day to la'aymer. You just say today's the second day. That's, that's enough. But the person is asking, he could count, he could count uh, with a brach, even though he he heard from you saying that. Even though he heard, and we said, when you're hearing, it's like you're saying it. When he heard it, he had a mind to, 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 to count again. That was his whole purpose. So why he was asking you in order, because I don't want to be Yitzhah now, and I want to be Yitzhah when I'm going to say it. That's why he's listening to you. He had in mind clearly not to be Yitzah from listening. But the person was answering, he didn't have a mind to, be, um, to, to count afterwards. Even though when, I, when you're answering, you have a mind, of course you want to say it later, but, you ha- you, but since right now you didn't have it clearly in your mind to say it, to, 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 to not be Yitzah, so, so therefore you're yetsa di chivas la imrashim sikh kavana, so therefore you're gonna be yetsa according to those that say you don't need a kavana. Ah, oh, but there's one way out of it, one of the tricks out of it, which which uh, I think maybe you said yesterday. He said, Avalim Lay Amar Lay Hayim Kahva Kah, Allah Heshali Stam Kahva Kah Laimer. I think you 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 asked this yesterday. He said, if somebody asks you Bena Shmash, what's the what's today? Right, and you say today is a ah, you say 13. So, so you you're not going to be eight. So, you didn't say today. This is the most important thing. You didn't say how you didn't say today. You didn't say today, so so you could still count, even though you said that the mom is today. Yeah, right. Mm-hmm. Even if you say t- this amount of days to the aimer, as long as you didn't say today, you're not yet. So, you could say it the bracha. Better not to get into, into iffy stuff, gray area. Say yesterday. <laughs> so this way, you don't make a mistake. You don't say today. You're like, oops, I didn't mean yeah. to say it. Because sometimes you say what you didn't mean to say, and then you have problems. So just so say yesterday was this amount of days. Okay. This is all talking about when he, when he asked you, what day is it? He asked you um, during Ben Hashemashas. Let's say he asks you before Ben Hashash, before, and it's still daytime, even though it's a plug in Minchah, before Shkia, before sunset, he asks you, what day is it? Even if you tell him today is the second day to the Emer, you, you, you could say it over the, with a bracha. Why? Because the main opinion is that that it's only you can only start counting from Shkia. You can't start counting from beforehand. Yeah. And it's only nighttime only for tefillah. You can only have a night of earlier, but not not Svidus earlier. 
Even those who say it's nighttime already now, the time sheet which says that it's that already from Plaga Minchas already nighttime. Some people say that even a mitzvah with Rabbanon, you have to have kavanah to be yitzha. It's a little tricky, but the Makoma came table is a pack of mincha. It's still better not to say even for pack of mincha. Okay, a little tricky. I don't know. I don't know if we spend time with this. It's a, a cheshbon over here. Okay, Tanzai. Okay, Mutter list for the next page. Tough line of the base. Tanzai. It's a little, little, a little easier now. <laughs> Mutter, this is what you were asking. You asked this question of her. Mutter, at least for Kain and Tzvilas Iris, the Filo Matzi Shabbos. So a lot of counts to the same before Maidiv. Even, uh, even a Matzi Shabbos. Shemesifim Mechila Kedesh. So let's say it's your, your, your. You have a long Shabbos Shudas, sitting in Shabbos Shudas. You're not. This man already passed, but you're sitting and having a Shabbos Shudas. You're seeing, you're seeing Kaechsef a little bit there with the Slavas. Right, you're going into Shal Shudas, right? You're going past the, the so the Chudah, it's still Shabbos, right? So how could you count Svidus Aimer if it's still Shabbos, right? Yeah, it's still Shabbos uh, you, you, because you because you because you never benched yet, right? You never done Maidav yet. You're still allowed to count Svidus. It's right now night. Right now, once it becomes a Zman, once it comes a Zman, it's Shabbos, it's nighttime. Being the next Shalim Avers, that considered the past, Elohim Mach is considered the next. It's considered the next day. It's considered the ready of the Shabbos continued into the next day. That's all that happened. Shabbos is continuing. You're being mamshich. You're being mesiv mechil al akedash. You're taking in from from Mati Shabbos. It's already a weekday, and you're making it also Shabbos dik. But when it comes to day and night, you're bringing the kishas Shabbos into, into into the next into the night. But it's already nighttime. So you're allowed to count Svira Sayyimah. So even if you're middle shal shudas, it comes as man. You're allowed to count Svira Sayyimah because it's nighttime. So still, it's better to have a night at first before Svita. Mm-hmm. Why? Well, there's, there's a rule. Something which is more, which we do more often versus something which we do less often, the thing which we do more often comes first. So, night is, is, is we do every night. Svita Saimer is only part of, is part of the year, a few weeks in the year. Mm-hmm. Therefore, we do Maidah, which is more Tadir, more, more calm, more often, done more often. We do it before Svira Saima. But it's mutter to do it before, but it's better to do first Maidah than Svira Saima. Okay, now what about. It says like this. What about. <laughs> the next. Let's say you dive a Maidah early and you read Kriyashma also early. Kriyashma Shalamita. He says, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He, he davens might have early. So he so, but since he davens might have early, he wants to be Yitzha uh, Kriyashma with when, when with the Kriyashma Shalomita, which he's going to say before he goes to sleep when it's nighttime. Before he goes to sleep, he's going to say Kriyashma Shalomita and say the three parshias, and he's going to eat the Kriyashma of nighttime with the Kriyashma Shalomita. Right, because he was because he died in night early and he wasn't really Yitzik, um, it wasn't Yitzik Kriyashma of night time because he died in night early, right? So now, like this when you die in night early, um, so, so, so if, 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 if usually we say you can't eat before Kriyashma of night time, right? But if you always say you always eat a Kriyashma. Uh, um, uh, with a Kriyashma Shalomita, you're allowed to eat beforehand because we know that before you go to sleep, you say Kriyashma Shalomita, and that's when you're going to say it. So, 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 therefore, you're allowed to eat beforehand. But in during the May Svira, you're not allowed to eat before you say Svira. So even though you're ready to have a Maidav, and you're going to say Kriyashma later, and, and you're allowed to eat beforehand. But since it's until you say Svira, you're not allowed to, you're not allowed to eat. That's what he says to me. You're not allowed to eat a, a Suda. We'll explain in a second what that means. You shouldn't begin to eat even a suda ketana chati shakaydam zman a svira. A half an hour, a half an hour before uh, the time of svira, and chati shakaydam in ashmashes, which means half an hour before, before sunset, before shkia, you shouldn't have a suda ketana. Zeda shema shema yimshek v'sudase. What's the word that if you're going to start eating a suda, maybe you're going to have a long suda. Even the Mr. Samer, if they get to, to, to count Sir Samer. Cool question for you. 
uh, I explained my situation. I, I can't disappear with my life. So, Motzi Shabbos, I come home from Shul. Should I do the Havdalah first, or should I do the Svira first? The Svira, we're going to get to there soon. Okay. Interesting, I never knew that. Okay. He's going to talk about it soon. He says, so he says like this, that's, wow. that, oh, so what does it mean Sudak Tana? What does it mean you shouldn't eat half an hour before? You shouldn't eat, you shouldn't eat the Sudak Tana. The Sudak Tana means you shouldn't eat bread more than a kebeya. Bread more than a kebeya. It's like, um, it's a, a kebeya is like two ounces or something. More, so more than that. Yeah. It's, um, Akazayas is an ounce. Akazayas is an ounce, right. right. So Akabea okay. is like around... Uh, two days. Yeah. So, so Akapanin, you shouldn't, you shouldn't eat more than that. But you could have a Zainas, you could have Pedas. Um, so, so that, that you, shouldn't, you shouldn't have before, um, before you, you did count the Tzvira. Um, he says, Elam Kino, Marcus Shanegan, Shalas, is a place, Marcus Shanegan, Shashamash, Kedal, this is Tzvira, Kedal, Shemagia, is manna that the Shamash comes and tells everyone, remember yeah. to, to, to count Tzvira. We're not worried that you're going to be mamshich in your suda and you're going to forget. So, so today, if you have a minion, which you usually go to daven with, so that's okay also. That also helps us also with cloud. We, we, that we, we, now you're going to daven a matter of nine o'clock. You know, I'm assuming a lot of people already, already had supper, right? A lot of you washed and had a, as a suda, you know, because you just had something, whatever. But, but it's still okay if you have a set minion mitzvah which you which you always uh, daven, so that's okay, right? Or somebody's going to remind you, tell somebody to remind you. you. Have to have some way, some mechanism. I feel them came this. Yeah. We learned the mission. Moshe Kashav is not saying tough day from one base. Yeah. That that is. Oh wow! Shkach apratus. You see, it's a learning table of shema. When someone makes early Shabbos, they start in the suda a half hour before they finish Shabbos. Oh, so what happens if you're making early Shabbos, but you already dab a mitiv? Oh, you didn't have Svira. That's a good question. What do you do? Because you know that you're going to have Svira, you, yeah, you don't know. No, that's a good question. Um, no, but on Friday night, the, the Gabbai in Shul announced. Everybody, when you go home, yeah, but when you're sitting, you're starting a pseudo. Fine, but he, he announced. Oh, he said the Gabbai's going to announce. Gabbai has to announce. The Gabbai's not, Gabbai not coming around to your house to, uh, to remind you. That's the announcement that everybody please say Kiyatma oh. and, and Sphere. Yeah, he's saying that it's not good enough. No, he's going to come in Kishamagia's manner, says. Shashamash Kay, this is Sphere Kishamagia's manner. Not in, in Shul, Kishamagia's manner. That's you, that's only you. Right, yeah, you see how, how you're going to make it. It's a good question. I don't know. It's a good question. I don't know what they, what they do. I don't know. You settle by Kiddish, like. Uh, I, forget, I forgot many times Friday night because I make during the Shabbos and I come down here and I forget. Wow. <laughs> yeah. So the morning the next day, the morning. Yeah. Wow. Okay, it's a good question. I don't know. Let's look into it. So I, don't, I don't know. I'm saying that a lot of people do that. I wonder what. The, no, most of the maybe, people. Maybe you are, are, most of the people. Ask you a question. Most of the people are davening. People yeah. daven night of early. On out of out of out of Shabbos, out of Shabbos, people daven out of Friday night, out of Shabbos, right? Tzvi'ah right? Shalim, right? So they count. They wait. When, when do they count Tzvi'ah at home, right? So the question is, how could they start the Sudda before? Uh, what do they do about starting the Sudda before Tzvi'ah Shalim? What? Half an hour before, before, before the That's supposed to start. Unless the shamash goes around. Yeah. So, uh, they have something to remind them. They, that's what they do. They ask somebody. So maybe they ask somebody to remind them. Wife to the husband, the husband to the wife. Uh, and what? Uh huh. They ask somebody to remind them. No, the Valdez, right? right. Russians was, they were just learning that luck, and that's what we're wondering. It's like, sure, well, it's it says that the Shamish is going to come around, and it's fine, or something. So you, so you ask somebody to remind you, basically. I don't know. That's what I'm assuming. Right. right. Okay, so they, what? that's what they do. They ask someone to remind them. Okay. Fine. So he says, I came in Shalei Nog, okay? And even though places you don't have a Shamish going around, going around the... Uh, even um, even even a place which not, the minig is not is not uh, to, to have a shamash reminding. Over if you the suda, say chati shav, some of his man asvira. If you began the suda, you were over. You began the suda in the chati shav before his man asvira. Ain't sarach la hafsik the ends of the dasi. No, it's a sarach la. Ain't sarach la hafsik the ends of the dasi. You don't have to stop a little before in the parentheses. Okay. Uh-huh. You, you don't have to be mafsik in the middle of your suda. Avlim hiskel la suda la achas shagi is man asvira. But if you began the Suda after it came to Svira, Sarakla Hafsik will disprev M Suda Suda. So you have to be yeah, Mafsik in the middle of your Suda. Because if you began the Suda after already came the time of Svira, so then you have to be Mafsik. 
How do people buy a second Seder counts to you? After, say after the Seder. They go back to the Shul. They, they go back to the Shul, Taka. They go back to Shul. Now we go to Shul. Yeah. 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 There are a lot of people who have seen them. Yeah. No, right, but yeah. Uh, it's brought, it's brought in the Siddha, yeah. Night Dodi Shop. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> uh, he, said, he said it's right. They, they say uh, they give us a van at 3 o'clock that they're all going to the... Or, yes. Yeah. No, no. No, you take it. No, After the Seder, this might have... Uh, but, but Rabbi Frankel, if you don't have Rabbi Frankel, no, no, bring myself in the highest. No, I know. I was done wrong by Rabbi Ovin at the. Uh, you are. It's not. It's not, not, it's not, not, not everyone has a many talent. This is the best chance to choose a guy. But you say it was. The, I think the Rabbi are not. The if you're here. not going, we'll have to sit there. Uh-huh. It's a little. I see. Right there. Yeah. Because most people tell in the house they don't want to run a Frankel or Rabbi Ovin. It's hell in the house. Mm-hmm. And the second I just feel. Okay. The first time. The first time. Tell you that. We do, we're doing the show. We're doing the show. Later. How do people tell us? We're doing it later. The second night. They're like, good night. We're going to have God. No, but we do. Yeah, it says in the city. I'll tell you the broad also, yeah. It's hell in the house. We do. We do. So. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah. So we do before. They do by Mark. You. Like, no, but it's saying about the, a lot of the Val does it. Right. Yeah. Right. This is by Rabbi Ruben, and this by Rabbi Franklin, and, and this by Baba 45. Do it at home. Uh-huh. Right? On the second night of Pesach, uh, myself and my wife did it uh, right before the Seder. Stood up. Right. And After. Should, should we? Uh, it was a piece of paper. Am I ready? Okay, so next year I'll know that we have to sing. No, 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 no. But I have a custom to do it w- with my wife. I agree with whatever you want us to start. I know yeah, examples yeah, yeah. now. Okay. okay, I think we should stop. Okay, Shkaya. Shkaya, okay, sure. Bye bye.